everybody, welcome back. This is MCP Redstone once again. Today we are back with another tutorial. Today we are talking about double piston extenders. Now, if you don't know what a double piston extender is, uh, let me quickly show you this. If you have a normal piston, you can place a block here, and when you activate it, it's going to push it to here, right? Well, with a double piston extender, you're gonna have two pistons and a block here, but when you push it out, it's going to be here. So that way you can use it in like 3x3 three three doors, stuff like that. Very, very nice thing to know how to do and how to use uh, because they are very useful. So how do you make a double piston extender in Minecraft Pocket Edition? So this is the one you're going to use if you're going to have a horizontal one. So let me quickly flick the lever and turn it off again. As you can see, it is going to turn on and off and pretty much retract nicely. Uh, now the way this works, very simple. Uh, once you activate this, it is going to activate this uh, piston and this redstone will be on as well so once this piston is pushed, this one will be pushed as well. Now when you retract it, it's going to be a bit different. Uh, this one is going to retract first, this one, because this is going to be turned off immediately. Then this one will be turned off uh, retracting this piston back to this block. However, uh, because of the fact that for some reason when you p uh, retract a piston that is holding a block, it doesn't take the, the block with it. So in order to fix that, we're gonna have this, these two repeaters give this piston another pulse. And if you wanna see that, you can put this in slow motion. So as you can see there, uh, when I turn it off, you can see how that works. Over here we have another version of this and this is pretty much a vertical version. So once you flick this lever we're gonna have ourselves a double piston extender going up. And once you flick it again, very simple, it's going to retract itself. So let's get on to the tutorial. Okay guys, now let's get into the tutorial. So the first thing that we're gonna do is make this version right here. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna place yourself two sticky pistons like so, any block you want of course to be retracted and pushed out right there. Then you're gonna place three repeaters, one, two, three, and redstone going all the way around. Then this one's going on four, this one's going on four, and this one's going on four. That's how simple it is. Then you're gonna place a lever right here and you can push it and pull it back and it's going to work perfectly fine. So for the vertical version it's a bit more complicated because you can't of course make this exact same thing uh, in vertical version so we're gonna have to do a bit of working around that. So what we're gonna do is first of all we're gonna place two blocks like so, place any block here because you're gonna destroy this one and then two pistons. So the next thing you're gonna do is place your block that you want to be using right here, any block here, two blocks like so and break the middle one then we're going to be putting our lever here, place three blocks like so, one, two, and three, very simple. So once you've done this, all you really need to do is place the repeaters and once again, do them all on four ticks, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one goes down here, also put it on four ticks, one more block here, place the redstone all around, which is here, here, and here, and now when we push the lever and pull it back, it is going to work perfectly fine, and there you go, that is how you can make a quick and simple double piston uh, extender. So now let's. I'm quickly gonna go to a build that I've made here that shows you what you can use this for. Uh, as you can see, this sh chest is being pushed out uh, quite far. It's going to be pushed out not just only in the wall, but all the way out of here. So. Yeah, that's pretty much this exact double piston extender that is worked into this as you can see That's how it works. That's what it looks like and anyways guys if you did enjoy this tutorial Make sure to leave a like subscribe and comment for more redstone tutorials and if you enjoyed this uh, Tell me in the comments what you want to see next uh, I will be making a ton more redstone tutorials of course and yeah, I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye